Hey guys, welcome back to One Month in My Bullet Journal. Uh, I lied yesterday, um, sort of. <laughs> I've, you've all been very sweet not to inquire what this little sticky note is doing on my calendar. It's actually covering up a party that um, was on Friday last night. Um, I'm actually filming this video Thursday evening in advance um, because... Yeah, uh, it was a bachelorette party for my sister, and it was a surprise. And on the off chance, like, I don't think she watches my videos, but on the off chance that she does, because she has access, you know? I did not want to spoil anything. Um, so I actually had a lot more on my plate on Friday than I let on in the video. Um, I obviously haven't done any of it yet, because I'm coming to you from the past. Um, but my plans are basically... Uh, as soon as I get off work, I feed the dog, and then I drive down to my sister's house where we're going to uh, have the party down there. It'll be a surprise. So I threw in a little, you know, washi tape and a sticker and a, some terrible lettering um, just to sort of celebrate the occasion and mark that. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's what my Friday entailed. That's why I was so good at um, getting stuff done earlier in the week and why my... Friday column here is completely empty. Um, cross off party now. That's what that meant. And some of the phone calls and text messages and emails and stuff that I've been marking on here are also for that. Um, I've tried to hide it in here as best as possible, which is kind of awkward, but um, that's, that's what's up. From now on, I don't think I have any secrets from anyone, so I can be candid for the rest of this series. But I'm going to go ahead and set up my Friday, uh, my Saturday now for you here in advance. Um, because after the party on Friday, I'm just going to kind of crash and then get up really early and drive. And I don't want to have to worry about setting anything up early, early in the morning or late, late at night. So let's just go ahead and get this header set up. See if I do a better job with it this time. Only two more chances to mess up. slower and more meticulously I do this, the more it's going to leak through to the other side of the paper as well. So I just can't win. But, let's see, where's the half point here? Middle. Just cannot win. So I hope you guys had a lovely Friday and you're looking forward to a good productive weekend or something fun. I have kind of a mix. I have a busy morning and then things will open up and I should have time to get some things done, but I don't have that many things on my plate to where it'll be stressful. So looking forward to that because I think I've mentioned before, my May is going to be crazy. I just have things planned for like every weekend and then a lot of busy weeknights as well. So I'm enjoying this relative freedom while I can. better than yesterday. I didn't have to wipe anything out. Go. Day. The 14th. Yes. There we go. I have to, I'm going to spend the night at my parents, but then I have like an hour and a half drive home early, so I have to leave by 
I never know whether things like leave by this time or whatever should be marked as events or as tasks. But I think I'm going to mark this as an event mostly because I'm not going to check it off when I do it because I'll be driving. But I'm going to put a little very important signifier there because I have to be... Put, oot, um, Jones House by 9.30 and then the event is at 10. Um, from 10 to 12, and then I have a chiropractor appointment at 12.45. That's already more events than I have in most days. Let's see. So, ah uh, yes. I think after that I should go shoe shopping. I was going to do that on Monday, if you recall, and then just didn't feel like it. I was tired Monday night. I think while I'm out... I, yes, definitely, because I can go to the mall that's right near there. Perfect. All right, this is getting a square box for, like, an errand. Shoe. Shopping. There we go. And then the only thing that is on my actual to-do list here for Saturday is dusting my computer. But I'm sure that come Saturday I will have thought of more things to do, but for now I think that seems fine. Rushing around all morning, coming home and just having one thing in the afternoon, and then everything else I get done will just be icing. Um, and just, yeah, hopefully, hopefully relaxing. I can only choose tasks that I enjoy, um, like sewing or, I don't know, cleaning the bathrooms. That's not bad. I'm not going to write that down. If the bathrooms need cleaning, I will do it when I get home, but I'm not going to write it down now. All right. Yeah, I feel, I feel really good about the way this works. Like, as far as, this makes more sense, honestly, to go to the mall to do my shoe shopping this day when I'm already down that direction for my chiropractor appointment. I should have thought of that in the first place. Anyway, that looks like a plan. So thank you guys for tuning in. Oh, I want to show you the pocket in the front I was telling you about yesterday. Um, what I was trying to say is that this front pocket is not particularly useful because it is so close to the insert that you really kind of have to like wiggle to get down in there. And then it's hard to get something that's not like stiff in there all the way. Um, so you can't just stick like a piece of paper in there, like a receipt or something, because it'll just kind of crush and squish. And Anyway, that was all I had to say. <laughs> but I couldn't because I had my uh, insurance card there and I didn't want you to see the account numbers because those are private. Anyway, thank you guys for tuning in again. Don't forget to subscribe. I will post another video tomorrow morning. See you then. Bye.